Okay, staking polka dot on the ledger. Um, kind of a pain in the ass, to be honest. Doesn't make very much uh, sense, but we're going to go through it. It's the highest returns um, if you can self-stake. You get a little over 14% on the ledger. Um, the best you can get in a centralized exchange is probably um, Kraken at 12%. But you know what you're doing is you're sending your dot to them and they're putting it in their wallets and they're staking it directly on the network and they're getting 14 plus percent, giving you 12, keeping two. So it's a nice setup for them. So a couple of things before we actually get into the ledger is this is a, like a hub to get uh, uh, explore the actual Polkadot ecosystem itself. Like in the back end, there's a lot of nonsense here. But you can go polkadot.js.org, apps wallet. And there's going to be a lot of things here. I would invite everyone to, um, none of it's going to make sense, but look around on it um, just to see what's going on. You know, nobody understands what an EKG looks like if they're not in healthcare. It's just a bunch of scribble. So, this actually stuff means something. Um, before we get into what I was going to show you, um, this within the Polkadot uh, ecosystem, this is some of the uh, different networks. If you want to get like a head start and try to find something, um, you know, click down here on test networks. These are... Um, all of the different uh, projects and protocols that are going to be trying to wind up uh, getting a parachain slot. Um, oh, hey, there you go, Cody. Origin Trail, <laughs> parachain testnet. So if you were scrolling through this list and you came upon Origin Trail, track, T-R-A-C, and you went to Google and you started looking it up, you might be like, holy cow, this is going to be a monster. And now you've got a head start before everyone else, you know. So take a peek at some of these. Um, this is the website under network go to staking here's something we should talk about for a second you see how there are two numbers this one's in red these are the validators a couple of things we need to discuss first if it says a hundred percent that's awful right that means that this pool takes all of the rewards and pays none of them out so you don't want to nominate here but of these validators only the top 256 people that nominate to these validators get paid. So in this, in this pool right here, you know, the top guy, it's 669,000 dot are bonded here. Um, you'll go down halfway point. And the lowest guy that's getting paid here, 137.8, right? These 41 wallets are not getting paid. Now, what's the difference here? 134, 136. So three dot difference between getting paid and not getting paid. And so this is someone that has nominated to the pool maybe a while back and they haven't gone back. There's more people with more dot. Um, and that's all I have to say about that, right? So if you're going to pick someone, because we're going to go through this list, if you're going to want, you have to see if they're oversubscribed. If they are, the top guy on the list is 251, right? So you better have, you have so not better, but you, you know, if you're going to nominate to this pool, you'd have to have more than 251 to get paid, right? I'm just curious, what's the difference? Here it is. 253 so two dots so if you're within and and they're all like this in the 100s or 200s so if you have more than that you generally don't have anything to worry about um but commission take a look at um and then make sure they're not oversubscribed um but this is the overview we're going to click targets so this is the returns that you can receive from these validators now in the ledger live app this is my ledger uh, i got a reward 0.94 dot 
you know, the day before 1.2, 1.1, you know, 1.7, 1.0, 0.93. So I, you know, it averages around one dot per day in rewards. Now, right now it's garbage. It's 20 bucks. It's nothing. But, you know, when dots $2,000, which don't kid yourself about that price, you know, maybe it's $2,000 a day, every single day, 365 days a year. I'm happy with that. <laughs> so, so accumulate now when the prices are low. And when these things, you know, Ethereum was $25 at one point. Nobody ever imagined $4,000. Bitcoin, when it was $1, $10, $25 like DOT is. You think you imagined $40,000, $50,000, $60,000? Not a chance. It's the same thing here. The market caps in relation to the size of what's going to be disrupted. I mean, this is... It's indescribable what's going to happen. So now I'm babbling. Okay, let's go back to staking. All right, now I've got to go into discrete mode. Um, this is the polka dot screen. Um, by the way, uh, this is how many uh, you're going to bond as you earn rewards that go in the available balance. So what can you do? You can send them out, start cashing them out, you know, um, it's just passive income, or you can bond them back and then wind up earning more polka dot. So manage, manage assets. Um, to earn rewards, first bond, then nominate. Bond. So how many? So, okay, so we could see this is some of what I've moved in. Uh, I've got 200 available. So we'll bond 100. Connect. Now this part, I'll probably cut out, but you can't see it. But I'm entering my code, number code on my ledger. Open Polkadot app. Polkadot ready. Okay. Retry. So what you can't see on the screens, please review, and you move to the right, staking, bond extra, to the right, the amount, 100, and then a checkbox for approve. This is happening off the screen. I click approve. It goes in, successfully bonded. Now I'm already, I've already selected my nominators. Um, Right now it's blocked, Damon. So as you can see, my total amount of dot staked is 2,038,986. Um, I won't go less than 2 million dot. So I, I have these 38,000 that, that I'm still keeping to the side that, I'll, that I might uh, consider selling if I want to take some profits. So, no, I'm kidding. This is just the total bond <laughs> for this particular validator. I don't have 2 million dot. If I had 2 million dot, I'm not doing anesthesia or making a video here. <clears throat> Probably, I don't know where I'm at. Um, but click nominate. Now, okay. This boss dog, oversubscribed, there's 306. I happen to know already because of the amount of dot I have, I'm still getting paid. So I'm not concerned about that I'm oversubscribed. But if you have 100, 200, 300 in that range, take note. You'll have to come in here every few weeks, you know, however, however often. Just go through, make sure you're not, you know, you're not oversubscribed. So, so you'll find some people, you know, th these are the ones that I have. Zug, Block Damon, Stateless Money, P2P, Bison Trails is common. You'll notice say, some of them are unelected. Um, some are elected. It's bizarre. I don't understand it myself. But, a, you know, a block happens, oh, every six seconds. In fact, it's somewhere on this, uh, in within this page here. Um, what happens but pick your subscribers click continue I'm gonna confirm that these are the ones I'm staking to 
that's the fee and it says off screen please review so move to the right staking nominate move to the right the targets it's going to go through all 16 addresses you keep clicking to the right 16 out of 16 and then there's a checkbox for approve click it successfully nominated my validators close now my bonded balance has gone up by a hundred my available balance since we knew i had 200 will now say 100 um, and then that's it there's nothing else to do you're going to get paid every day you are going to either rebond that um, or you're going to cash it out something to note though when you bond um, to unbond it takes 28 days um, it's a it's not uh, for trading <laughs> or anything this is a long-term hold and this is about all you're going to do with it you're never going to do anything else you are buying the infrastructure the computer programs what people will eventually interact with is far away um, I'm not, I shouldn't even get into all this. I'm going to shut this off so I can get this out of here. Um, this is how you nominate on, and this is how you stake Polkadot on the ledger. It's 14% in that range. Um, and that's it. All right, guys.